All four of these wet wipes are made from basically the same materials. Polypropylene base with random scrubbing fibers also made from polypropylene. The weight of the wipers ranges from 38 GSM to 48 GSM. Look how all these wipers tend to tear and pop apart. This is especially bad if you are using these wipers to scrub and clean rough, sharp, or irregular surfaces. I give the orange one a score of 4 for the strength and durability test, and the others a 2. They all fail pretty readily. Dirty's wipes are made from spun lace and have a smooth side and a beaded side to help scrub the caked on materials. The weight of Dirty's wipes is 93 GSM. They are very strong in all directions. I can't even push my fingers through it. This wiper would be very good on all types of surfaces and will do the job. Dirty's rough and smooth gets a 10 on the strength and durability test. Next, we will be taking each scrubbing wipe and we'll drop it on two ounces of colored water. We will drop the wiper on the liquid and see how fast and how much of it wicks up. All these wipes don't wick up the liquid and most leave liquid behind. They all tend to leak liquid back out after a short time. The orange wipe did the best out of the group and I will give it a four and the rest did not so well, so they get a two. Dirty's rough and smooth wicks up all the liquid, leaving basically nothing on the surface, and nothing drips out. We even have enough left over to clean up after the other four scrubbing wipes fell short. Dirty's rough and smooth gets a 10 on the wicking and absorption test. Dirty's is the obvious champion above all the products it faces. Dirty's wipes with a difference.